Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to run any OS on Windows 11. You can begin create a new virtual machine running Windows, Linux or another operating system. Here I'll be demonstrating by running Ubuntu on Windows 11. So let's take a closer look at the procedure. At first, download the Ubuntu 22.04 LTS. This is the latest version. Now you need to enable Hi-Fi-V in Windows 11. To enable Hi-Fi-V manager, go to Windows search and search for Windows features. Now you will need to enable certain Windows features Hyper-V options. Then click OK. Keep patient and let Windows install the necessary files for this feature. When it's complete, just click restart. Once your PC restarts, go to Windows Search and search for Hi-Fi-V Manager. Now launch the Hi-Fi-V Manager. This tool allows you to create and manage your virtual machines. Right click on the host computer in the left column and select new virtual machine from the action menu. And click next. Name your new virtual machine as you want to. Select a custom location where you want to store the virtual machine. And click next. Select Generation 1 and click Next button. Specify the memory size in MB format. Remember that when you create a virtual machine, it uses your host machine resource. So if your PC has limited hardware resource, then you don't need to assign too much RAM or storage space to a virtual machine. Now select default switch to connect the virtual machine to network and click next. After that specify the virtual hard disk size. I will be allocating 40 GB for Ubuntu 22.04 LTS and click next. Now select install an operating system from bootable image file and select your Ubuntu 22.04 LTS ISO image file. and click next and click finish alright you have created and configured your new virtual machine you are now ready to install the Ubuntu 22.04 LTS OS now go to settings 
After that, switch the processor section on the left and set the number of virtual processor value to at least 2. After that, click OK. Now go to Action menu and click Connect. And click Start. Now please keep patient. Now click install Ubuntu. Select your keyboard layout and click continue. Now check this box and click continue. Select erase disk and install Ubuntu. Don't worry about this because we have already allocated 40 GB space for Ubuntu. Just click on install now. And click continue. After that, select your location and click continue. Now type your name and type your password for your user account. And click continue. Please keep patient and let it foot install. Once done, just click restart, that's it. Now it's completely ready to testing new apps, settings and even unstable vlog OS. So I hope this simple guide was helpful for you. If you have any question then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. 
and guys please don't forget to subscribe our channel thank you thanks for watching have a nice day